Hello guys and welcome to my channel. In this video, I would be explaining you free vortex and force vortex flow, which is a, a important topic in the fluid mechanics. Now, what is free vortex flow? Free vortex flow means that the fluid it requires no energy or no external torque. The fluid can flow by itself, just like a whirlpool. Whirlpool. If you have a washing machine, when you drain, the motion is a free vortex flow. That is the spiral motion of the fluid and uh, towards the center, that, that is free vortex flow. And the equation, that is the angular momentum is constant. So angular momentum is given by mv into r. So it is constant. Now v is equal to r omega, so substituting. So m into r omega into r is equal to constant or now mass remains constant. So omega r square is equal to constant for free vortex flow. And you remember that Bernoulli's equation can be very well applied on free vortex. Now what is force vortex? Force vortex flow is when a fluid is rotated about a, a vertical axis. That is this, is this is the vertical axis about it. It is rotated using external energy and the speed is constant for each and every particle and that is the each particle have the same angular velocity and the general equation is given by V is equal to R omega. We have to supply external energy or torque to produce this motion. Bernoulli's equation cannot be applied. Remember Bernoulli's equation cannot be applied. And when you rotate this fluid that is on force vortex motion, uh, the there is depression at the center and there is rise at the ends and there is fo formation of a convex surface, sorry concave surface, there is a formation of concave surface and uh, this is the height h at which the fluid rises, initially the level of the fluid was this dashed line but after at the ends it rises to h and h and the height of this is given by omega square r square by 2g where h is the height of paraboloid now this is the paraboloid this is in 2d if you rotate in 3d you will get paraboloid so h is the height of paraboloid r is the radius of this cylinder from here to here, R is the radius of cylinder, omega is the angular velocity by which you have rotated the fluid and the volume of this paraboloid, it is given by pi R square H by 2, that is, it is half of the circumscribing cylinder. Now, this was the video regarding force vortex flow. If you have found this video helpful, please like this video, comment on the video, please share this video as much as you can. Please subscribe my channel by pressing the big subscribe button below and also tap on the bell icon to get notifications from, my, from this channel. Also check out my other videos. All the links are given in the description. Please watch those these videos that are appearing on your screen right now. And uh, if you have any suggestion, feedback or doubt, please mention in the comment section below. Do follow me on Facebook, Twitter and Google+. And uh, till next time, take care. Bye-bye.